on your left. Oh, sorry, on your right. On your uh, left, you know, these nine students are going to oppose the views of these students. Right? They are going to oppose. They are going to say, India does not need nuclear power at all. That's what, you know, they are going to say. And by way of introduction, I must uh, tell you, you know, a few things about it. People feel that we need uh, nuclear power for our betterment, for our progress. But at the same time, we should not forget that there are some dangers because of the ill-maintained reactants. And uh, there are as many as 30 reactors in India are now under construction. People have so many doubts about uh, the, the very construction of the power plants. Will the power plants will be very safe? Because you know there may be radiation, radioactive uh, radiation you know emitted from the power plants. So all this. Ready to move into Madhuri Gallery. I am Monica Nancy from the Department of Information Technology. And today's topic is nuclear power in India. I think it is a very hot topic today because India is suffering from the power cuts spontaneously nowadays. To overcome this power cuts in a very fast, in a very uh, short time, we need nuclear power plants in India. From my point of view, nuclear power is not needed because why should we go for nuclear power plant? What is the source of that? We can produce electricity. We can produce electricity by another method. Um, except that nuclear power, we can produce electricity in solar panels. Each house can be produced electricity by, by solar panels. And then in nuclear power plant, they are, they are emitted radioactive materials. It contains more number of, more number of harmful gases. It emitted from the uh, industries. It, it directly goes to the villages or uh, anything surround that. So they are affected by cancer or any other harmful diseases. Um, we could not recycle the waste particles in that nuclear, nuclear power plant, but we can but we can recycle by some other source. From the government of Faro. And my opponent team said that uh, the power plant is, an, is not a radio issue and you can uh, sustain power from some other sources. But there is a carbon emission from some other sources. By this nuclear, react, uh, by this nuclear power we can uh, reduce the carbon emission and we can also reduce the green, af green gas effect, I mean greenhouse effect. And also it is used in the space mission uh, profiles. Uh, instead of using this chemical uh, chemical reactants and uh, uh, instead of using solid propellants and liquid propellants they are emitting more amount of uh, uh, pollutants uh, which can affect the atmosphere and by using this nuclear power in space ships or space flights uh, we can reduce those emissions and we can also achieve the efficiency in that means from uh, space you know power plants we will remain in the world. Please note the radiation emitted from these plants will remain in the world for more than hundreds of thousands of years. And just imagine, you know, the gravity, the seriousness. And the people are afraid that the environment, you know, will be polluted. When our environment is polluted, what will happen to our human life? This one. And we can have these plants provided if adequate facilities for disposing of waste, if they are made available. We must see to it that these waste must be, you know, buried deep and it should not in any way, you know, affect our human life. Number one. Number two, the, the reactors you know should be surrounded by concrete walls and steel walls so that you can uh, prevent the escape of radiation. 
unless the walls are very strong or the walls are you know uh, built in steel is very difficult to prevent the spread of radiation this must be ensured so this must be properly disposed and walls must be very strong and we should have the cooling system some provision must be made to continue the cooling system very much you know the radius will affect the, the deeper and one more thing what happened to the what is the where is the safety for the employees so the employees must be saved while working you know inside the plants they must be provided with proper gloves overshoes respirators everything must be there so protective muscles you know must be ensured